We are here today outside the London offices of Hewlett Packard to demand Hewlett Packard stop its complicity in Israel's war crimes. Most people think of Hewlett Packard as an innocent office supplies and printer company, but the reality is in fact far darker. Hewlett Packard is one of the top 20 arms companies in the US with arms sales worth $3 billion in 2011. The Stockholm International Peace Research Institute has done the research and when they say arms sales, they define that as goods and services designed specifically for military purpose and doesn't include general purpose equipment like office computers. They also state that the figure may be underestimated as it doesn't include classified contracts that Hewlett Packard might be involved in. In Hewlett Packard's own words, Israel is one of the few countries where Hewlett Packard has a massive presence. In the past decade, Hewlett Packard has invested over six billion dollars in the acquisition of Israeli companies, including the establishment of production plants. Hewlett Packard is the second largest investor in Israeli IT. Hewlett Packard implements and manages the server farm for the entire Israeli army and Ministry of Defense. Israel's largest server tender worth $140 million. Those Hewlett Packard servers form the IT backbone of the entire Israeli war machine, which has been found guilty of war crimes and possible crimes against humanity by the United Nations Human Rights Council. In 2009, Hewlett Packard was contracted to supply all computer equipment to the entire Israeli army. Shame on you, Hewlett Packard! Shame on you! Last year, Israel adopted 1,266 Palestinian children. That's one child taken from their parents every seven hours. 40% of the 600 that were taken from Jerusalem alone were sexually abused by Israeli soldiers during arrest and interrogation. Stones and tanks, and we'll never really know how many people are dead. They shot those of innocent. 